Okay, Beano Black here, folks, and this is where we start out. I.e., don't ever presume or assume anything, okay? Don't assume that, or presume that everything's okay, because it's not. I.e., visit, I.e., watch the graphics, they'll go crazy. Uh, big money, power and control, or Kerasoft, it doesn't really matter. Uh, always playing games. This is my site. Uh, this is my pirate site. You, just about everybody, I would encourage you to try to get one. Make one for yourself. Okay, you go here and you will find out, and I will show you that, yes. Now they brainwash you that 300 is a safe number. No. Okay, I will take sole responsibility for the idea that my actions pretty much more than likely probably brought the volume down off of the radnet. Go here for all my and you'll be able to click on these and be able to watch the idea that the chemtrailing is more than just one thing. It's the super giants and the baby the baby blue planet that's out there. Okay. I am Beano Black, ladies and gentlemen. There is a man from Missouri that people have messed with. Government power control. Uh, he exposed harp. Okay. Uh, honestly, perfectly straight out. I'm a male, alpha. Uh, don't really give a <laughs> uh, Dutch a dude. You know, there for you. But the idea that rats ass just doing this for the public. Uh, good shepherd. The idea that uh, let's see what has happened to someone who talked about rats and harp. And he may have just taken a vacation himself. Uh, who knows? We will see. I He's from Missouri. Uh, I, I'm from America. Uh, anywhere in America. So the idea that if you watch the clock, we know what time it is right now. We'll move down and you'll be able to see the clock here. Central Standard Time. Doesn't matter where I'm at. There you go. 1.44 p.m. So one hour earlier right now is basically live today, 11-11-2011. Uh, I want to put it out to all vets, if anybody's paid attention to Stonely's site uh, and or my site at any time in the past. A thousand percent of the time, go USA, USA, all vets, male, female. Uh, if you watch the clock, you will see the idea that there is a volume. Okay. On the 11th today, it is not 1,700 hours. East Coast time today, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, there's the box and there is the volume that basically, once I spewed the truth, they took the volume off, which I wanted to tell you everybody. So that the idea they knew the truth, that the idea that the rads are higher, the CPM is higher. Forget what you're seeing here, okay? Because the idea they open and shut the box to try to manufacture a good CPM rate. This is from Missouri today at 11:11. 2011. I have friends and family on the married other side, plus, yes, my precious is down there. Okay? And also, our f friend Dutch from our chat room. Okay? So the idea that this morning, 11 11, they ended up with a high count of like 89, which is high. Okay? That's not normal CPM. We're getting it from Fuka Fudge Up. Okay? Now, I don't know if it's going to show here the idea that it was 89 or something this morning, but it should have seen it a little bit ago. That they started off the day at something like, yeah, they had like 90 CPM this morning. 82 and 91 and 90. Okay, those are all honest readings. Even this, but the idea that they open and shut the box more than what they need to. I.e., watch the clock. Okay, that's on the 9th. i got to watch the dates here. So let's go down to the 11th. They had 89 and the 10th, and here we are on the 11th, okay? So the 11th this morning, if you watch the clock, we start out with, they got that there, and then we scroll. Now, anything above 34 or so would have been a beginning of a warning.
before Fuka fudge up. Okay, so all this here is Fuka fudge up and honest readings. Okay, but I E watch the clock. Okay, and I'm just telling you straight up, they're right on top of me. So that whatever I'm looking at, whatever I'm trying to record, and straight up, folks, this morning, uh, it was 89 or something like that, and then they started fudging with the clock. As you can see, they now show 1,700 hours, and it is should be officially 2:47 p.m. in the afternoon right now in Missouri, okay, because it's 147 Central right now, okay, so they've opened and closed the box to get these smaller readings, okay, and you always want to look at the beta gross because beta gross is what everything is, and you see how they manufacture and keep it right here at a nice somewhat concerning safe level. 130 is danger, okay? They have brainwashing everybody now that 300 is safe because there's lots of areas in the United States right now that have a high altitude. And yes, when you get to a higher altitude, and the truth bleeds so honestly, and I want to thank NBC and the Today Show because the idea that yesterday on the 10th they had a d show from... Switzerland was they take the one guy and he goes around the country and they don't let anybody know where he's at pretty much in there guess where he's at. He was in Switzerland and they even mentioned the idea that when you get to a higher altitude you have a higher CPM radiation. They straight out said they didn't say CPM they didn't say RADS. They said well, you have 20% higher radiation at that altitude. They're at like 11,000 plus square feet at one of the highest railroad yards in the world. Okay, uh, Over there in Switzerland. Okay, So the idea that if you pay attention to the United States if you go to a high altitude you're going to have higher radiation. Rads are in the sky. They fall out of the rain. Keep your kids dry. Wash their clothes a lot. Vacuum a lot. Uh, it's not a good time for the next few years to be playing in the rain. Okay. Uh, eventually, Mother Nature will purify what we have. We never are going to run out of water. There was a symposium a long time ago. You boil a kettle in a closed enclosure. We have our stratosphere. As long as we don't blow a hole in it and everything escapes into the space, and that shouldn't happen, the idea that we're never going to run out of water. You boil a kettle, the moisture rises, and it falls, okay? I.e., harp in weather modification. I.e., hide the blue planet and the other objects that's going on in space, okay? So, if you cruise around uh, the RADS query, and also there is a one that I'm not going to have time to show you the address here, and I'll put it on my website either my super giants or my YouTube and you will see the uh, you can go look at the graph and the graphs really don't lie uh, until they we hear this video and then they probably will start lying on the graphs if you go to these old if, if you can get anybody that's got old ones of this they used to have a volume at the end here there is no more volume anymore because the idea they open the box up and what it is is the measurement box where the idea that they clean the box out and you would do that at any time, and automatically every hour it cleans the box out. But then they start cheating the clock because they get high readings, so they change over and go to IE. It should be 250 right now over in Missouri. This is in Missouri. So the idea that it should be 1350 is one. This should be, and then they started cheating because they scooted ahead. We got 1550, 1651, 1751. That's not that time right now, East Coast, Missouri. Okay, I've showed people this in the past in Dutch's, and this is what happens to people who tell the truth or what is going on, or he's just getting harassed so much that he just said, screw it, I'm going to take a vacation, get off the internet. That's fine. Don't really care which is that or the other. We will see Dutch again. Dutch is not going to disappear. All right, so let's go take a look at what's going on at his site right now. Okay, this is Dutch's backup channel, okay? And I don't care if he gets mad about me showing his, because I'm basically not showing his info, but it's, I'm not blacking this out, okay? His channel is compromised right now. This is the backup one that he had to make up because of the idea that something was messing with him, okay? Big Barney, power and control, who knows, okay? So, they knocked his YouTube down, he had to go to Facebook, and I don't like face. No one really does if you got a brain because the idea that they let everybody, why would you want to expose your whole family to the whole friggin' world all the time? Here's my picture of my this, that, everything, my loved ones. I'm not going to put my loved ones all over the internet and let everybody look at them. So anybody can do what they want, okay? Make yourself happy. Okay, so now but let's go to his original Dutch sense with the S. So here you are, the original Dutch sense with the S, okay? You can see the address up there. In future, I would suggest to keep going to these. 
uh, these sites should be okay, either that or he's going to let us know, and I will eventually let you know what his new channel this is or that is, or he'll have these back up. So watch all my videos about in outer space. Uh, I'll keep you in touch on rads here on Earth or anything else that's going on on Earth that you need to let know about that propaganda big media won't let you know about. All right, so watch the clock. Uh, they shouldn't be able to take the clock away, which is the idea they have the measurement start clock on the end and at the beginning. So hopefully maybe we can force the EPA to start letting us see the truth of what's going on and quit lying and we can tell with the clock. Now that's one good thing is the software they originally designed everything like that, they can't tamper with the clock. Yes, since we're bitching they probably will eventually figure it out how to tamper with the clock and then we won't know that. Okay? I have no apologies to anybody. I am bleeding the truth, letting you know about Rad CPM. Okay? They took the volume off the top. It was up here like one of your counts, better gross or anything like that. They won't let us see the volume. They have to empty the volume in the dustpan every time they make a new. If you're going to have to do a new sterile test to see what's going on, you got to have clean gloves. That's why they empty the clock out, and that's why you end up with these false readings that look everything's all safe and all right. Okay, let me go see if I can get a uh, high reading somewhere in the United States today. All right, folks, I eat Veterans Day today, so I figured we'd go to the heart of America. And yes, I did already kind of know that it's going to be high here. And yes, it's dangerously high, okay? But at that altitude, we're going to have a good 20% or who knows, a little bit less than that or up to 20% higher readings, okay? Now, this is the day to the 6th through and you can zoom back and slow down and everything like that. So now you will see today that the idea that it is not 1,900 hours right now in Denver, Colorado. And the reason I just plopped over there is pretty much close to the center of the United States. And I, we know the civil defense and everything like that. And we know about the mountain with the big old door. Still in operation today. The good thing about American defense is we can scatter control anything from just about anywhere on the face of, yes, all universes pretty much, okay? So it's not 1,900 hours right now, so you know that they're cleaning it out there to try to give you good readings, okay? I.e. maybe real-time live with my recording here that I'm making, because yes, they have the ability to look at your computer screen exactly what you're watching. And yes, duh, they can pay attention. If you've got satellite TV or cable TV, they can know exactly what the hell you're watching on your TV set. Okay, folks? Wake up. Okay, so now we got 11, 11, 32 they opened up with, okay? Those are some high readings up here that they had the other day. Don't let them BS you with the idea, well, that's the one where we cleaned the machine out or the high reading. Yes, they do have a spike. You will see a spike every once in a while. It'll be one reading a day. It's always been that way, just one reading a day, okay? So you can see some of the highness that it's plopped to in certain days. Now, don't get me wrong. Certain days will be low, okay? But these are high through the last 12, 11, 07, 06, okay? And yes, we saw close to, there you go, 367,403. That's not healthy, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, now, there we go back down, and this is all of America, folks. This stuff is floating around, and the Fuku flood job is not still covered up. Okay, so they've opened it up a lot today to try to clean it out and make it look good, and they still can only try to keep it down around 109. Okay, 130, you're in trouble, and, and basically 148, 151, 143. Okay, so, and yes, I know, black and white, folks. But the idea that this is the air that you are breathing and it's out there, okay? So yesterday, 205, 210. Uh, today, what did they have high that they started? Who knows what they had high today and they started playing with it and locking it out. Might have been the videos yesterday of the idea of starting me back on busting chops about CPM. Yes, your president, your pawn lied to you about dangerous rads going to be on this i.e. he said Hawaii his yeah home state yeah right birth certificate live birth certificate buddy and the idea that I'll out and just basically bust everybody's chops today for all US vets because they want the truth they didn't almost die or die for their US citizens to be lied to about anything okay we pay our tax dollars we want to see this stuff where is the volume Here's the measurement. I am showing them playing with the clock. They can't take the clock away. They are going to readjust this to make sure that you can't see this cheating anymore. Okay? CPM rads are high here. Somebody technically should have had those nuclears over in Japan shut down a long time ago. That is NATO and world leaders that the idea that they should have known that there was crap over there. Old technology being messed with in a high earthquake area. And those damn things are still bleeding out radiations. 
all the cesium 131 137 all kinds of crap okay and they are playing with the clock we have high radiation ladies and gentlemen legal disclaimer 